Hey all you straight fans, I hope you guys are doing awesome as today we're going to be taking a look at a new upcoming horror game called Carnival Hunt and it, it's being developed by Beer Night Studios and apparently their Kickstarter is coming up here pretty soon and so I'm definitely going to have to get on the train and watch for this game as it's a first person asymmetrical horror game where four people get to play as bunnies, one gets to play as the Carnival Hunter or the Hunter and yeah i am all for horror games so let's see what this game has to dish out so so far this is just the cinematic teaser trailer all right it looks dark and gritty i like it so there's the bunnies okay so you have a turn key so i'm wondering if you have to help each other by looking for each other's turn keys something along those lines Oh man, look at those gangly fingers. Oh my god, that face is horrifying. Jeez, I love carnival games. And there we go, launching on Kickstarter here pretty soon, and I'm definitely gonna have to be on that boat. Oh my gosh, look at the dark and grittiness of everything. Oh my god, jeez. Is it munching on fingers? It's munching on fingers. It just ripped out your key. Holy smokes. Wow. Wow. Oh, man. Okay, okay. So I'm wondering if it's going to be very similar to the sense of Dead by Daylight? That's a pretty popular game in itself. There's still tons of people playing it, and it's still coming out with more and more content. So maybe this game will give it a run for its money. So I wonder if there's different hiding mechanics in which you can like maybe hide behind corners, peek corners, uh, maybe hide in toy boxes possibly. Oh man, that face is like the stuff of nightmares. And it's like mustaches moving here. Are those like leeches or something? Oh, and you get to be part of a closed beta? Ooh. Ooh, I might have to sign up for that. So I'm wondering if this has to do with one of the powers of the hunters where they control like a sort of mimic doll to kind of go looking for you. But that, that's scary. I like it. I wonder if there's also going to be stuff like jump scares. That'd be kind of nice every now and then. Um, hmm, so many questions, yet the game looks so, so interesting. I'm already invested into the game. Let me slow things down a little bit. Maybe I can break some stuff down. There wasn't really too, too much there, but I'm still going to see if I can try to break some of this down anyway. But all right. Hmm, are they carrying anything? Nope. So I wonder if you can hide as the hunter because we see them in a sort of locker back there there's also boxes hanging from the ceilings maybe you can trap certain bunnies maybe certain people put them in a jail cell oh man and i really hope the level of detail retains in the actual game i also wonder if it's going to be coming out for consoles so stuff like PlayStation and Xbox? Maybe the Switch? I doubt it'll handle something like this. But oh my god. The glowing red eyes. Oh, I love it. Yeah, his mustache is like pulsating. There's gotta be like leeches or something. To have jump scares with that face? Hmm. I would absolutely love it. Footage captured in game engine and may not represent the final game. All right. Well, you can only expect so much, right? But as long as it's pretty similar to what I'm seeing here in this uh, in this scene. Oh man, that mangled smile. I love it. Yeah, you can you can see the fingers just sticking out of his face. Oh my god. Now the other question begs is whether or not this game is gonna be free to play. If it's not, 
but it still keeps its graphical fidelity, then I probably wouldn't mind as much. I'd, I'd definitely pay for this game. And I don't really play too many of these sort of like 4v1 games. The one that I played was Evil Dead. Um, and unfortunately, that there were so many complications going on with it due to like nerf to the survivors. And I talked about that in a previous video, but that's a whole nother can of worms. You guys should look into that if you are still thinking about getting um, Evil Dead. Man, oh man, I am super invested into this game. This game looks really creepy so far. I'm also gonna have to keep up with that Kickstarter page. Oh, so many games on my bucket list. Thank you.